हेलो एवरीवन हाय किड्स हाउ आर यू ऑल नमस्ते एंड सलाम वालेकुम पीपल हाय दिस इज मारिया खान योर मास्टर टीचर ऑफ बायोलॉजी हियर एट वेदांतु गाइस वेलकम टू द सेशन एंड टुडे इज आवर सेकंड सेशन ऑन आवर एनवायरनमेंट वेयर हैन वी आर गोइंग टू अंडरस्टैंड द फ्लो ऑफ एनर्जी इन एन इकोसिस्टम इन द प्रीवियस सेशन वी डिस्कस्ड अबाउट कंपोनेंट्स ऑफ एन इकोसिस्टम टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट द फ्लो ऑफ एनर्जी इन एन इकोसिस्टम ओके सो वी विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट फूड चेन फूड वेब Uh, 10% of transfer of energy and flow of energy as well as nutrients. So, are you all excited? Hi, Shahil, Madhyansh, Khushi, uh, Vivek. Good evening, Bacha Party. So, I would request you all to call your friends, ask them to join in. Here, Mazedar session होने वाला है. The chapter has a five marks weightage. Plus, uh, today we have a mentee along with the session discussion, of course. so i'll be giving you tips and tricks i will give you uh, suggestions that this question is important this kind of question could be asked in examination so yaar uh, get benefited from the session ask your friends to join in and uh, chalo let's get started let's get started bachcha party yeah so yeah hi farzana ayushi so hit on the like button everyone hit on the like button come on chalo शुरू करते हैं हम है ना लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड मैम आई अनेबल टू सी दी प्रीव्यू नाइ दर कैन आई रीड दी मैसेजेस वाई इज इट सो लाइव चैट हाँ ना आई एम एबल टू सी चलो सो हाँ सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड मोहम्मद जैद आस मी एवरी टाइम मैम इज देर एनी मेंटी यस डू वी डू हैव अ मेंटी ओके वी डू हैव अ मेंटी तो चलो without wasting any further time let's get started okay so first thing first let's talk about the flow of energy in an ecosystem but to understand that we need to understand that there are producers then there are consumers and then there are decomposers in an ecosystem am i correct am i correct am i correct producers consumers and decomposers these are the three different components which exist in an ecosystem the biotic components now if we talk about the consumers okay now consumers are herbivores or they are carnivores or they are omnivores however if we uh, talk about the prey predator relationship okay so there can be one prey and it can have multiple predators okay multiple predators or there can be a uh, one predator which can prey upon multiple organism right yes or no for example uh if there is a tiger okay tiger will feed upon tiger will feed upon tell me tiger will attack and feed upon whom chalo come on tell me the prey predator relationship ha madhyan sure you're absolutely right okay deer apart from deer apart from deer a tiger may feed upon ha are you all are like telling me deer only apart from deer any other organism you don't know cow okay cattle hmm so basically tiger can feed upon munch upon variety of herbivores do you all agree do you all agree do you all agree so one predator can have multiple preys okay or maybe one prey can be served as a food to multiple organisms for example uh, a grasshopper may feed on grass cattle may feed on grass and even uh, um, the goats they may feed upon grass right basically they leave uh, eat leaves plant leaves not grass technically speaking but yes uh, insects can feed upon them and uh, multiple variety of insects may feed upon them do you all agree 
so in the nature in the environment there always exists a prey predator relationship okay understood understood there is a prey predator relationship now because of this prey predator relationship there is a sequence of organisms which forms due to the passage of food like one organism feeds on the other and in turn that organism is consumed as a food by some other organism as a result there is a formation of a linear chain and this linear chain is what we call it as a food chain okay theek hai so if we see that there, there are trees on the trees the deer feeds and on the deer the tiger feeds one food chain another food chain grass insect uh, frog snake eagle another food chain right ha huh. and then again plants your insect that scorpio okay aquatic ecosystem i guess this is okay and uh, maybe it can be small fishes okay large fishes and then the stock feeding upon it okay ha huh. so there are multiple food chains that are operating in an ecosystem okay now the level at which an organism obtains its food pay attention to what i say the level at which an organism obtains its food is called as a trophic level okay so who are the producers guys who are the producers who are the producers that exist in an ecosystem tell me quickly 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 green plants perfect so green plants utilize the light energy can anyone tell me how much light energy is utilized by the green plants how much light energy is utilized by the green plants and converted into chemical energy green plants manufacture food in the form of glucose correct it means they convert light energy into chemical energy that's glucose so plants utilize only 1% of the light energy how much percent 1% there should be no confusion here only 1% of the light energy is converted into chemical energy by the green plants and this chemical energy serves as a direct source of food or indirect source of food for the entire biotic components that exist within an ecosystem amazing yes or no hai na so these green plants who manufacture their own food from the base of a food pyramid and thus thus they are present at the first trophic level so producers occupy the first trophic level in an ecosystem okay theek hai now the herbivores feed on the green plants herbivores they are the consumers who directly feed on the plants and thus they are known as primary consumers so primary consumers occupy the second trophic level okay now the other organisms usually the carnivores okay like here you can see the fox hai na they feed upon the herbivores so they occupy the third trophic level okay now the organisms who are either omnivores like human beings or bears or maybe such kind of carnivores who are the strongest predators who feed upon others no other organism will feed upon them such kind of consumers whom we call it as apex consumers okay why apex they are present at the top of the food pyramid they will feed upon others no other organism will feed upon them okay so they occupy the fourth trophic level understanding understanding 
so in this given food pyramid we can see there are four levels right each level at which an organism obtains its food in a food chain is what we call it as a trophic level okay theek hai now queen danza pyramid of biomass number energy we are not talking about anything okay we are just talking about food pyramid okay that's it food pyramid okay chalo hmm now but you let's talk about the flow of energy now i told you that 1% of the light energy is converted into chemical energy by the green plants let's assume that this is 10000 kilo calories okay theek hai now as per the 10% rule of law of transfer of energy what's the law it's law of transfer of energy okay now this 10% rule says that an organism will use some amount of energy for its own life processes this digestion hai na there is maintenance of various body organs this growth this reproduction there are so many things happening in our body so some amount of energy is being utilized by the organism for its own life processes some amount of energy is always lost into the surroundings in the form of heat can you see that heat energy is being lost heat energy is being lost heat energy is being lost and then whatever energy is being left that is being made available to the organisms present at the next trophic level understanding okay so to make it very simple for you kuch use kiya kuch lose kiya kuch pass kiya कुछ यूज किया कुछ लूज किया कुछ पास किया मीन्स सम अमाउंट ऑफ एनर्जी इज बींग यूज सम अमाउंट ऑफ एनर्जी इज बींग लॉस्ट इन टू द सराउंडिंग्स इन द फॉर्म ऑफ हीट एनर्जी एंड ओनली लिटिल दैट इज जस्ट मियरली टेन परसेंट ऑफ द एनर्जी इज बींग मेड अवेलेबल टू द नेक्स्ट ट्रॉफिक लेवल इट इज बींग मेड अवेलेबल टू ऑर्गेनिजम्स प्रेजेंट ऑन द नेक्स्ट ट्रॉफिक लेवल सो द ग्रीन प्लांट्स आर हैविंग टेन थाउजेंड किलो कैलरीज ऑफ एनर्जी and if as per this 10% law of transfer of energy okay if they are transferring how much only 10% so what will be the amount of energy made available to primary consumers how much energy guys how much energy how much energy tell me quickly tell me quickly quick 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 कुछ यूज किया कुछ लूज किया कुछ पास किया जेड ये कुछ क्या है एनर्जी है ओके क्विक चलो जल्दी टेल मी हाउ मच अमाउंट ऑफ एनर्जी विल बी अवेलेबल विद दी प्राइमरी कंज्यूमर्स प्राइमरी कंज्यूमर्स क्विक इट विल बी थाउजेंड किलो कैलरीज ओके नाउ अगेन एज द लॉस इज टेन परसेंट इज बींग ट्रांसफर्ड सो इफ वी से दैट हियर अगेन टेन परसेंट इज बींग ट्रांसफर्ड सो हाउ मच विल बी अवेलेबल विद दी सेकेंडरी कंज्यूमर्स क्विक 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 हाउ मच विल बी अवेलेबल विद द सेकेंडरी कंज्यूमर्स इट विल बी हंड्रेड किलो कैलरीज परफेक्ट now again 10% energy is being transferred again 10% is being transferred so what will be the 10% of 100 kilo calories what it will be what will be what will be the answer it will be merely ouch it will be merely 10 kilo calories okay 10 kilo calories now imagine an organism feeding upon the apex consumers they will get only 1 kilo calorie now out of this one what will they use what will they lose and what will they pass so that's not practically possible the amount of energy an organism who feeds upon the apex consumers will be so minimal that it won't be sufficient enough even to fulfill the routine biochemical processes and thus 
दस एवरी फूड चेन हैज थ्री टू फोर ट्रॉफिक लेवल्स एट द मैक्स नथिंग बियॉन्ड दैट सो वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट गिव रीजन इज बिंग आस्ट इन दी एग्जामिनेशन दैट अ फूड चेन हैज मैक्सिमम थ्री टू फोर ट्रॉफिक लेवल्स जस्टिफाई योर आंसर ओके सो यू विल राइट अ फूड चेन कंसिस्ट ऑफ प्रोड्यूसर्स कंज्यूमर्स एंड डीकम्पोजर्स the level at which an organism obtains its food is known as a trophic level as per the 10% law of transfer of energy only 10% of the energy is made available to the next trophic level so in this manner the amount of energy available at the apex consumers or the at the highest trophic level is so less that it won't be sufficient enough to uh, fulfill the energy requirements of the organism who would feed upon them and thus the number of trophic levels in an ecosystem is always limited to 3 to 4 okay understood understood guys if you have understood this question hit on the like button subscribe to our channel do not forget to hit on the bell icon because here we ensure that we are providing you quality content quality content so if you want to score good in your exams if you want to have crisp understanding of the concepts score concepts like share subscribe okay chalo yeah great now bachcha i said a single prey may have multiple predators a single predator may feed upon multiple prey and that's the reason why the different food chains op operating in an ecosystem they may eventually get interconnected at different trophic levels forming an intricate network forming a complex network of interconnected food chains so this complex intricate network of interconnected food chains is what we call it as a food web it's okay chanchal beta de raha hai durust hai understanding it understanding it so a single prey may have multiple predators a single predator may feed upon multiple prey as a result various food chains operating in an ecosystem get interconnected at different trophic levels thus forming an intricate network so again फूड वेब का डेफिनेशन इज बिंग आस्ट फॉर वन मार्क ओके दे मे आस्क यू टू कंप्लीट अ फूड वेब ओके दे मे आस्क यू की विच ऑर्गेनिजम इज एट वॉट ट्रॉफिक लेवल सच काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन दे वुड आस्क वी विल एक्चुअली हैंड पिक सच काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन एंड वी विल प्रैक्टिस इट मे बी समाइम लेटर इन दी सेशन स्टे विद मी डोंट गो एनी वेयर ओके सो नाउ लेट्स टॉक अबाउट द फ्लो ऑफ एनर्जी इन एन इको सिस्टम ओके so tell me what is the driving source of energy in an ecosystem ki without that a food chain cannot operate a food web cannot operate an ecosystem cannot exist only which is the driving force which is the driving force bachcha party it's sun right so 1% of the light energy is being utilized by the green plants right so it is being utilized by the producers okay now from the producers it goes to primary consumer then it goes to secondary consumer then it goes to tertiary consumer then it goes to apex consumers right now at every trophic level some amount of energy is always lost into the surroundings in the form of heat right in the form of heat so every trophic level some amount of energy is always lost into the surroundings in the form of heat now this heat energy it never returns back to the sun will it return back to the sun ever bachcha party tell me will this heat energy that has been lost into the surroundings will it ever go back to the sun jayega kya kabhi jayega kya no right and thus thus the flow of energy in an ecosystem is always uni directional understood understood flow of energy in an ecosystem is always unidirectional now let's talk about flow of nutrients in an ecosystem 
ठीक है चलो सो लेट्स राइट डाउन दस ग्रास ओके देन दस ग्रास हॉपर देन दस फ्रॉग देन दस स्नेक देन दस ईगल ओके एंड फाइनली दस बैक्टीरिया एंड फंगाइ ओके नाउ यू गाइस टेल मी ग्रास इज प्रेजेंट एट विच ट्रॉफिक लेवल ग्रास इज प्रेजेंट एट विच ट्रॉफिक लेवल विच ट्रॉफिक लेवल ग्रास इज एट यस देर इज अ मेंटी देर इज अ मेंटी ग्रास इज प्रेजेंट एट विच ट्रॉफिक लेवल फर्स्ट ट्रॉफिक लेवल ग्रास ऑपर ग्रास ऑपर सेकेंड ट्रॉफिक लेवल फ्रॉग 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 क्विक 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 फ्रॉग थर्ड ट्रॉफिक लेवल स्नेक्स 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 फोर्थ ट्रॉफिक लेवल ईगल 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 अरे भाई कहा चला गया एम सो सॉरी या ईगल इज प्रेजेंट एट दिफ्थ ट्रॉफिक लेवल वॉट अबाउट बैक्टेरिया एंड फंगा है वॉट अबाउट बैक्टेरिया एंड फंगा है डू दे ऑक्यूपाई एनी पोजिशन सेपरेटली एज अ ट्रॉफिक लेवल सिक्स ट्रॉफिक लेवल साकेत से सिक्स ट्रॉफिक लेवल अदर्स वॉट से ओपिनियन सिक्स्थ नो चल सपोज इफ ग्रास ड्राइज एंड इट डाइज इट्स डेड बॉडी विल बी डिकम्पोज बाय बैक्टेरिया एंड फंगाइ सिमिलरली इफ अ ग्रास हॉपर डाइज और मे बी अ फ्रॉग डाइज और इवन अ स्नेक और ईगल डाइज इवन देयर डेड बॉडीज विल बी डिकम्पोज बाय बैक्टेरिया एंड फंगाइ so whether it's the first trophic level or it's the last trophic level any organism existing at any of these trophic levels if they die their dead bodies will be acted upon by bacteria and fungi and that's the reason why bacteria and fungi basically the decomposers are considered to be a part of every trophic level they are considered to be a part of every trophic level understood 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 चलो इफ यू फाउंड दिस इन्फॉर्मेशन टू बी इन्फॉर्मेटिव लाइक शेयर सब्सक्राइब चलो एक लाइक तो बनता है भाई वैल्यूएबल इन्फॉर्मेशन है है ना या चलो द नेक्स्ट कॉन्सेप्ट ओके ग्रास प्रोड्यूसर्स ग्रास ऑपर प्राइमरी कंज्यूमर फ्रॉग सेकेंडरी कंज्यूमर स्नेक टर्शरी कंज्यूमर ईगल एपेक्स कंज्यूमर ओके ठीक है एंड बैक्टेरिया एंड फंगाइ डीकम्पोजर्स सो फॉर एनी फूड चेन इफ देर आर सपोज थ्री कंज्यूमर्स यू विल राइट प्राइमरी सेकेंडरी एपेक्स इफ देर आर फोर प्राइमरी सेकेंडरी टर्शरी एंड एपेक्स बट एनश्योर दैट फॉर एवरी फूड चेन यू मस्ट राइट अ प्राइमरी कंज्यूमर एंड एन एपेक्स कंज्यूमर ये दो होने ही चाहिए मैंडेटरी ओके ओके इज दैट क्लियर इज दैट क्लियर perfect now plants take water and minerals from the from the plants utilize water and minerals from the from the from the from the chalo tell me plants take water and minerals from the soil of course so they take it from the soil shabash and bacteria and fungi okay bacteria and fungi they decompose the dead bodies and make this minerals available back into the back into the soil yes or no 
so these minerals which we call okay they are actually these minerals are actually the nutrients for the plants yes or no so when we talk about the flow of nutrients okay uh oh not the highlighter i want to use the pen yeah so when we talk about the flow of nutrients the flow of nutrients is always cyclic so you have heard that song from kesri na tere mitti mein mil jaawa gul ban ke main khil jaawa means what i am getting added into the soil and i am again blooming from the soil means what it is the flow of nutrients so every song every movie every book every story teaches you something gyan charo aur bat raha hai lapet lo right yes abhishek humus is a decomposed matter organic matter okay understood 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 मैम जब ऊपर वाले ट्रॉफिक लेवल पे एनर्जी कम पहुंचेगी तो व्हाई आर दे मोर स्ट्रॉगर देन ऑर्गेनिजम्स ऑफ लोअर ट्रॉफिक लेवल बेटा सी द बेस ऑफ द फूड पिरामिड ओके प्रोड्यूस अ मोर इन नंबर एंड एज लेस अमाउंट ऑफ एनर्जी इज अवेलेबल विद द एपेक्स कंज्यूमर्स द नंबर इज लेस नंबर इज लेस लाइक यू विल फाइंड प्लांट्स एवरीवेयर एवरीवेयर यू पीप आउटसाइड योर बालकनी यू विल सी प्लांट्स बट यू पीप आउटसाइड योर बालकनी यू वोंट बी एबल टू सी लायन टाइगर चीता एंड बेर्स है ना अनिका वॉट शुड एक्सप्लेन यू अगेन वॉट शुड एक्सप्लेन यू अगेन चल मी दी टॉपिक पिन पॉइंट टॉपिक आल एक्सप्लेन ओके चल सो लाइक शेयर सब्सक्राइब एंड पोस्ट मी आई यो गाइज एंड नाउ हाउ मेनी ऑफ यूर डिसाइडेड की आफ्टर माई टेन आई विल ऑफ फॉर केमिस्ट आई मीन आई विल ऑफ फॉर साइंस और कॉमर्स और आर्ट्स ये कितने लोगों ने डिसाइड किया है ये बताओ जरा जल्दी मुझे जल्दी जल्दी कम ऑन जल्दी 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 Why am I not able to see the messages? Ha. Now I am. Sakit says I scored 37 out of 40. Good, congrats. Mm. Anika says she'll take maths. Means basically it's uh, science. Hana says PCMB. Great. Beta, I would recommend either go for PCB or PCM. Don't try to sail in two boats together. Okay. Abhishek says I haven't yet decided. So beta, decide. Karu kal kare so. Aaj aaj kare so. Ab beta, you kick start early. Okay. अच्छा फ्लो ऑफ न्यूट्रिएंट्स इन वन शॉट बेटा प्लांट्स एब्सॉर्ब न्यूट्रिएंट्स फ्रॉम दी सॉइल फ्रॉम द प्लांट्स दे आर पास्ड ऑन टू एनिमल्स एंड व्हेन द प्लांट्स एंड एनिमल्स दे डाई डीकंपोजेस ब्रेक डाउन देयर बॉडीज एंड रीलोड द न्यूट्रिएंट्स मिनरल्स बैक इनटू द सॉइल एंड दैट्स द रीजन व्हाई इट कम्स फ्रॉम द सॉइल इट गोस बैक इनटू द सॉइल एंड हेंस द फ्लो ऑफ न्यूट्रिएंट्स इज साइक्लिक ओके यप पीसीएम ओके कंफ्यूजन इन पीसीएम एंड पीसीबी beta try to uh, write pros and cons of both these streams uh, see what's the calling of your heart ki mujhe kya karna hai and finally shortlist one okay so bachcha party why did i ask you this question it's very crucial for us to know okay because the early you start the better you prepare for your college section okay for example when i was in college na 11th grade till december i was like in my own wonderland like karan johar's student of the year wala movie this competition that competition this festival that festival and then 12th standard started for others and i was still in the happy bubble of my 11th grade then when actually 12th grade officially started in my college coaching mein to 6 mahine pehle ho jata hai back then everyone was ahead of me and i was lagging behind and uh, even in 12th i was like theek hai na this is june exams to feb mein hai till november i was clean mold trust me guys i used to get chills ki main kya karungi so don't be like me have a clarity 
have a clarity and uh, decide which stream you want and now that you have decided ki uh, science i want to take a commerce i want to offer or it's the arts that's the calling of my heart enroll now okay colleges will start at their own pace and timing again corona will affect uh, the sessions conducted in the college so the primary source that you rely on is either coaching or youtube if you can afford enrolling yourself into coaching nothing like it and for today i present you vedantu's uh, course okay with 30% off with my coupon code how about it interesting 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 hai na it should not be i am presenting vedantu is presenting with my coupon code a 30% off on the courses for neat or je theek hai so let me take you there so this is the ongoing session of mine hai na our environment so you go to the description box click on the link go to the description box and can you see grade 10 and two years je grade 10 and two years neat so when i say this what is this grade 10 beta your exams are very close almost one month ka time hai aap logon ke paas mein hai na to we offer you a one month revision course for grade 10 so that you pass your boards with flying color and you start your 11 12 ka journey whether it's neat or je with full josh with full josh okay so har bar mein neat dikhati ho je dikha deti ho by the way it's it's it will be the same okay when it comes to the price point so you prepare for your je 2024 plus we give you term 2 ka revision so that you are prepared for your boards okay and uh, we have three three subscriptions to offer light classic and plus the basic difference is with uh, light you get the basic course with classic you get a doubt you get a doubt solving app and with plus you get a personal mentor trust me light is more than enough okay so you get live classes test series assignments personalized report card doubt solving during the class okay actually the course price is 71999 now if you compare this price point with any other offline coaching classes they would charge this only for your grade 11 grade 12 multiplied by 2 neat and je additional cost okay so now this 71999 means probably 72000 has been reduced down to 53999 okay so use my coupon code that is makpro mac pro to avail this 30% discount okay and uh, i mean overall 25% discount to be very precise okay and uh, join now that's what i can say or else maybe try out a 15 day subscription hai na 15 day ka kitna hai 1349 and with my coupon code that is mac pro you get 15 days extra means at 1349 means 1350 1350 mein you enroll with us for an entire one month and you experience the goodness of je or neat faculty right and sakib singh ma'am sure short session for icc lesson wise and mock test paper yes but i'll bring i'll bring a session on that okay rest assured relax fine so bachcho enroll and what's my coupon code मेरा कूपन कोड बता दो उसके बाद मैं बिल प्ले मेंटी चलो जल्दी टेल मी व्हाट्स माय कूपन कोड सो एनरोल गाइस लाइट एट 53999 दिस इज अ वेरी लोएस्ट प्राइस पॉइंट एंड वन मंथ यू कैन ट्राई आउट एट 1349 टेक्निकली इट्स जस्ट 15 डेज बट विद माय कूपन कोड यू गेट 15 डेज एक्स्ट्रा ओके चलो Hana says I have enrolled in Vedantu for two years. Yeah, I know it was a special offer wherein the master teachers uh, donated so that our kids don't stop learning. Okay, yeah. Hmm. Chha. Uh oh. Yeah. So now, one minute, bus. I menti chalu karti hu. Bhai, Mumbai is too hot. Forty-two degree Celsius. सच्ची में हाई गर्मी वाला माहौल हो रहा है आप लोगों के यहाँ क्या हो रहा है ज 
जल्दी 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 चलो जल्दी क्विक अरे आई एम सो सॉरी आई एम सो सॉरी हाँ ज्वाइन इन द मेंटी है ना म्यूजिकल जर्नी से ट्वेल्व डिग्री वेड यू स्टे इन कश्मीर मध्यान्ह से एसी के बिना काम नहीं चलता और मैं यहाँ गर्मी में परेशान हो रही हूँ पंखा ही चला लेती हूँ हाश चलो ज्वाइन इन फास्ट ज्वाइन इन फास्ट हिमाचल वाव है ना इनवाइट मी टू योर प्लेस नेक्स्ट वीक आई हैव अ हॉलीडे आ जाती हूँ मैं हिमाचल आई एंजॉय द कूल कूल वेदर हियर यू नो इट्स फोर्टी टू डिग्रीज फोर्टी टू भाप रे चलो 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 वेज अजान अजान वेन डाउन टू प्ले He came back from school and now he is out to play. Jaldi karo bachcha party. I can see twenty three kids on the chats. Three eight double three six five three eight. Three eight double three six five three eight. Three eight double three six five three eight. Come on. ट्रू मध्यांश ट्रू चलो कमॉन कमॉन जल्दी 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 क्विक 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 चलो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड ओके वी गो सो आंसर फास्ट टू गेट मोर पॉइंट्स द बच्चा पार्टी द अमाउंट ऑफ एनर्जी दैट फ्लोस फ्रॉम वन ट्रॉफिक लेवल टू अनदर इन अ फूड चेन इज इज अमाउंट ऑफ एनर्जी फाइव परसेंट टेन परसेंट ट्वेंटी परसेंट फिफ्टीन परसेंट हाउ मच इज दर्सेंट क्या बात है बच्चा पार्टी येस ऑफकोर्स इट्स टेन परसेंट ओके then let's see the leader ball so we have suhana the invisible lincoln after a long time welcome beta arvin sami z is je tougher than neat beta if you are determined nothing is tough okay madhyansh do you know beatboxing yes i know sai priya ayushi shri ranjini Harshita Ganesh Reddy congratulations and let's proceed further okay yeah shall so here we go with the next answer fast to get more points huh? which of the following are primary consumers primary consumers carnivores omnivores herbivores producers chalo batao jaldi come on so of course herbivores are the primary consumers then small carnivores are secondary consumers large carnivores are the tertiary consumers hai na and the omnivores are the apex consumers theek hai char So, Suhana, Arvind Sami, Ayushi, Invincible, Lincoln, Madhyan, Sai Priya, Harshita, Sai Ranjani, Zed, Ganesh, congratulations and let's proceed with the third one. Okay? Yeah. 
so here we go with the third question flashing on your screens now sure dash is the driving force of the ecosystem solar energy carbohydrates biomass atp come on quick so it's solar energy congratulations 1% of the solar energy is utilized by the green plants and converted into chemical energy that's glucose stored in the form of starch and then that chemical energy is passed from one organism to another organism through the food chain correct hai na hi prathamesh bade bade dino baad aaye ho ma'am go to rajasthan beta i uh, i went to rajasthan in the month of october or november i guess in diwali i celebrated my diwali in rajasthan and it's a super awesome place ayush arvin sami sai priya harshita invincible lincoln madhyan shri ranjini ganesh suhana zaid congrats congrats yep then next fourth question flashing on your screens now koi baat nahi hai na we learn from our mistakes Which of the following is a linear arrangement of organisms? Linear. I told you it's a linear sequence of organisms formed due to the process of eating and getting eaten up. Food chain, food web, trophic levels, community. Food chain. Congratulations, congratulations! Yes, bacha party. Food chain is the linear and the intricate network is called as the food web. मुझे कुछ नहीं लगता आरुषि. See, the more the merrier. Even there is a one child and the one child is getting benefited with free quality education that is provided over YouTube. The purpose is served. Okay, we work for the cause, not for the mass. आयुषी हर्षिता अरविंद सामी इनविंसिबल लिंकन मध्यांश गणेश श्री रंजनी साई प्रिया अभिषेक सुहाना कॉन्ग्रेट्स या एंड द लास्ट क्वेश्चन फ्लैशिंग ऑन योर स्क्रीन्स नाउ कम ऑन विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग लिमिट्स द नंबर ऑफ ट्रॉफिक लेवल इन अ फूड चेन लिमिट्स वॉटर polluted and air and water deficient food supply decrease in energy at higher trophic levels hmm. chalo batao jaldi batao so as we climb up the food chain okay or uh, a food pyramid the amount of energy available at every trophic level goes on decreasing so more the trophic level lesser will be the energy available with the highest trophic levels and that is the reason why the number is limited to 3 to 4 okay uh -huh. congrats priyansh congrats and now let's see who is my official chintu candy for the day on the leader board and here we see ma'am when will there be a next session on class 10 next years abhishek if you are talking about next year that will be in the month of april okay congrats ayushi congrats you are my official chintu candy for the day so congratulations heartiest congratulations and well played everyone guys and uh, now it's time for the homework question okay to hum bhai yahan aate hain seedha hum yahan aate hain okay so homework question okay mm. flow of energy is always uni directional you have to give reason okay for this question 
okay so yeah tell me your answers in the comment section below and uh, use my coupon code that is makpro to enroll with vedantu 11 12 je need or uh, even if you are a ninth grader you can uh, enroll for a uh, ninth bridge course 10th grader or 10th standard bridge course and this bridge course will definitely be catered by your youtube master teachers hum lenge wo to aa jao bhai enroll karao okay and uh, that's it for the day if you enjoyed the session like share subscribe post me a yo and let's meet in the next session till then allah hafiz मतलब वापस एंड कीप वाचिंग वेदांत तू बाय बाय बच्चों बाय बाय टेक केयर या